In this tutorial, you'll see how to revoke a user's access to one or multiple resources. In your JumpCloud admin console, navigate to User Management in the menu on the left and click Users. First, we'll go over revoking access to a specific resource, and later, we'll go over a full deletion. To revoke the access to a resource, simply search or scroll to find the user, navigate to the correlating tab containing that resource, and unbind the user from the resource by unchecking the box. Within 60 seconds, the user's ability to access that resource will be revoked. To completely offboard an employee, you can perform a full user deletion. This will remove all access to any resource their JumpCloud user account had access to. In this case, select the user and check the Delete User button in the top right. Confirm the number of users being deleted. In our case, we're deleting a singular user, so I'll enter one to confirm. Once this has been confirmed, the user will be deleted from JumpCloud and access to all associated resources will be revoked. JumpCloud in no way deletes user accounts or associated data. It simply revokes access by changing the user's account in the resources from enabled to disabled or suspended. For example, on their device, their system log will be disabled, but the home profile will remain on the file system. Also, G Suite and Office 365 users will be moved into a blocked or suspended state. This way, as an administrator, you're still able to pull that data from their accounts when needed. That's it. Check out our other tutorial videos for unbinding, deleting, or suspending users.